Welcome back to our hungry adventures. Guys, yesterday I left Koh Samui and arrived to Suratani, where I had 9 hours of amazing sleep, and which is why I feel so energized today. <laughs> and today's episode is gonna be a road tour back to Bangkok, which is located in 650 kilometers away from here. And I believe the road is gonna take around two days because I wanna do a few stops on the way to show you some cool places with amazing views and restaurants with delicious Thai food. Maybe even markets with street food. <laughs> there are cool markets on the way. But since it is a long journey, I've come to GPX Suratani to check my motorcycle, to change oil, to make sure that all systems are working properly. Yeah. And this GPX shop is combined with Lambretto motorbikes and also with Royal Enfield motorcycles. And I got a feeling that Royal Enfield might be the next bike I'm gonna have because I, there is a model which I really, really love. Let me show you which one. This is it, Royal Enfield Himalayan. I got no idea why I love it so much, but it looks amazing. Are you surprised? I'm not. Welcome back to our Hungry Adventures. ครับเอาน้ําพริกด้วยอันนี้ดีกว่าใช่มั้ยครับผมอันนี้ครับอันนี้ครับ <laughs> Pinas. Pinas. อ่าอันนี้ตัวตัวต้มเหรอไม่ต้มไม่ต้มอ่าอร่อยอันนี้อะไรอันนี้ตีฟู้ดอันนี้ฟู้ดซีฟู้ดไอไม่ใช่ข
It's just so good. สวัสดีครับพวกมีอะไรบ้างครับตอนนี้ทริมอะไรอร่อยที่สุดนี่น้ำได้ไหมครับได้แต่ว่าน่าจะทานไม่ได้เพราะมันเผ็ดไม่เผ็ดไม่อร่อยใช่มันเขาอยากกินเผ็ดอันนี้อ่านได้ไหมอันนี้อ่านได้ไหมอ่านได้ไหมได้ได้ทานอะไรดีเนื้อหมูนี่ซุปซุปใช่ไหมครับซุปเนื้อซุปเนื้อ่เผ็ดเผ็ดใช่ไหมโอเคเอาเอาซุปเนื้อแล้วก็อะไรนะครับต้มยำกุ้งต้มยำกุ้งอร่อยอร่อยอร่อยกว่าต้มยำกุ้งเลยเนื้อเนื้อซุปแล้วแต่คนชอบแล้วแต่ชอบผมคิดว่าเนื้อเนื้อซุปแล้วก็เอาเพราะว่าผมผมเห็นถ่ายรูปถ่ายรูปที่ที่กูเกิลจะทำทำอาหารทะเลด้วยใช่ไหมครับมันหมดฮะหมดเหรออ๋ออ่ะกุ้งมีไหมกุ้งมีอ่าเป็นผัดกะเพรากุ้งแล้วก็ซุปเนื้อไหมใช่ครับอ่าผัดกะเพรากุ้งลาดข้าวใช่แล้วก็ซุปเนื้อถ้วยหนึ่งอ่าไข่ดาวด้วยด้วยไข่ดาวโอเคขอบคุณครับขอบคุณครับ Mark up. Okay, Miki, you wanted something spicy, and this is something really spicy. Spicy beef soup with lots of green chili. Just look at it. Lots of beef and lots of chili. And almost nothing else. Madness. Yeah, this is real challenge. My pet, my aroy. Mmm. So tender. Ah, sour, spicy, a little bit sweet. เป็ดเป็ดเสบเสบเสบอิลีโอเค we are ready to go to Isan travel to Isan again very spicy but so tasty man รอยมาก and this is bat kapao kung Some leaves and three huge prawns. Just look at the size of this prawn. Massive, really massive. And also lots of chili. These are river prawns. You see, they got these long claws. I will need it tonight for sure. After eating so much spicy food, I will need it. <laughs> wow, this is great. 
ปัดกระเป๋าปุ้ง Very tasty. And as you see, this is a simple restaurant located right next to the road. You probably can hear a lot of traffic noise. Nevertheless, in places like this, you can enjoy fantastic, authentic Thai food, spicy food, and not expensive. Couple words for subscribers. Couple words for subscribers, please. No? Couple words for subscribers. Mickey's touch on YouTube. Good day, mate. Good day, mate. If there is a 7-Eleven, there is always street food, delicious street food nearby. So I stopped and I found this place. There is a gentleman selling grilled barbecue, 10 baht one skewer, and a lady cooking omelette with different topping, toppings and grilled pork, also very cheap. And as you see the sky, colors of the sky, yeah, rain is following me everywhere. I just left Chumpon, yeah, I've come from this way, from this direction. And it's gonna be raining here maybe in 20, 30 minutes. And here, in this direction, the sky is much clearer. Prashuap Kirikan is, is over there, Bangkok is over there, so we gotta hurry up. But I really wanna taste this street food. This is a street food video, street food motorbike tour. Let's try it. Yeah, this is beef, 10 baht, one skewer. And here is the omelette with various toppings, some pork and rice. So I've got four skewers of beef for 40 baht. And this one for 60 baht, so total 100 baht for this lunch, for this breakfast. And I've got a feeling that it's too late. The wind is getting stronger, it's getting darker. So yeah, probably I'm gonna stuck here for a while. Mm. You cannot buy such thing in 7-Eleven. There are many good things in 7-Eleven, but freshly grilled skewers of beef only along the road, only on the street. Deliciousness.
Okay, let's go. All right, magic box is in the place and we are ready to go. We've already ridden around 350 kilometers from Sorotani to Brochu up Khan. Yeah. And there is 280 more kilometers to Bangkok, but we're gonna make it today, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. And last night I spent in Wellington Hotel again, one of the most amazing hotels located close to the road. And even though the one night cost 850 baht, it is really worth it. The quality of the room, the quality of the mattress, pillows, everything was created for ideal good night's sleep. Yeah. And they recognized me and they gave me a hand wash as the gratitude for the video. Yeah, very nice of them. All right. <laughs> this thing doesn't look good, so we better get going. Let's go. ครับอ่าแนะนําได้มั้ยครับแนะนําได้มั้ยครับเพราะว่าปมเห็นรูปทีนี้มีกุ้งพิเศษใช่มั้ยครับกุ้งบุ้งกลางกลางๆใช่
抽嘅。ดูเรียนมาจากที่ไหนปาลาอูปาลาอูเหรอหนึ่งกิโลทะเลาะครับสามร้อยอ่าเพราะว่าปาลาอูจอกที่สุดอร่อยที่สุด Guys it's two more hours drive to Bangkok but I just can't miss this opportunity and try durian first durian this year I've noticed there is a shop And I ask, where is the durian coming from? And this durian is from Palau. Palau is a district of Prech, of Prechuap Kirikan, closer to the Myanmar border, around one hour drive from uh, Hua Hin City. And in the farm, price for durian is 200 baht one kilogram. In the farm, yeah. Here, price is 300 baht one kilogram. However, in the city, it usually sold around 400 baht uh, one kilogram because it's really the most delicious durian. In Thailand, yes. Yeah. Last year, I visited Palau district, and it was amazing. Beautiful, beautiful road, many mountains. You can even see some wild elephants walking along the road, or see some elephants poo poo on the ground. Anyway, I just need to buy a couple durians and eat it here or eat it at home. From our song, look, ning look lek, lago ik look yai, dama kap. ว่าผมอยากกินเลยอยากชิมเลยครับโอเคอันนี้เขาได้ไม่ได้ยินอันนี้ก็ได้อันนี้ก็ได้ลดไม่ได้ใช่ไหมครับลดได้พันสี่ทวดลดไปเจ็ดสิบบาทโอเคโอเคขอได้แต่ผมอยากเปิดปัดเปิดเองตามเองได้ไหมครับเปิดอยากเปิดตามเองได้ไหมครับได้ไหมได้ได้ I miss this feeling excitement when you're opening durian
gangway. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm a surgeon, like a doctor, Dr. Durian. The king of fruits. This is the most amazing durian, Pala U. A little bit crunchy, crunchy on the outside, soft inside, without crazy smell, without crazy ta taste. Really something like strawberry, vanilla, something creamy. Absolutely amazing. If you ever will be traveling to Hua Him, try Pala U durian. You won't regret. Wow. And this is the phone number in case you want to order delivery because they can deliver it even to Bangkok. back to Bangkok <laughs> and surprisingly it's not raining here yeah it was a long journey and I want to thank you for being part of this journey it was an amazing trip and I really hope you have enjoyed at least one episode of this southern Thai tour and if you have enjoyed it you can hit the like button share this video with your friends and subscribe to this channel if you aren't already because new adventures are coming soon I believe they are coming soon bye bye